So what you like to add ads into Instagram, I'm going to show you how to do this in a very easy way. The very first thing you wanted to do is to understand the Instagram ads. Now, Instagram ads are one of the most powerful platforms of the advertising right now because there's a billion active users each day. So whether you are promoting a product, service, or branding Instagram, ads can help you reach your target audience effectively. So to get started, first of all, you need to have access to an Instagram account. Just open any tab, go into Instagram.com. And once you have access directly into Instagram.com, you want to recreate an account or just sign in with a usual common user account. Now, if you focus here into the left pod that says more, I'm going to click here and look out for the option that set the settings. Into settings, I'm going to change my account from a personal account into a professional account. So once you've done this process here into four professionals, you can choose to be a creator account or a business account. In our case, we now have access to a business account. So that means that we are now able to run ads, create much more elements, and even sell directly here into Instagram. We have a lot of common um, tools now directly into the professional Instagram. The next thing to do is to connect your Instagram account directly into Facebook Business Manager. If you go here into business.instagram.com, you can always focus here into the upper side and of course go directly into the section that says start now. So here, what you can do is to look out for creating an ad. If you don't have access to creating an ad, that means that we have needed, of course, we needed, of course, to focus into the meta business. So let's go here into meta business suit. Into meta business suit, I'm going to click here. And it's going to be really important that you have a Facebook account in order to uh, continue. So I'm going to hit into get started. And into get started, it's going to be asking you to sign in with your Facebook account or you can use Instagram. Once you've used Instagram, you can always click here and create your very first portfolio. If you don't have a portfolio, focus into create a business portfolio and you're actually good to go. Inside the business portfolio, you can of course link your both Facebook page and Instagram account here into the upper side. As you can see, we have the Facebook page and Instagram profile. In your case, since you don't have one, let's go for connect Instagram and connect your Facebook page. Once you have actually done this process, then what we can do is to start to run some ads. Now what I need to do is to just verify that I have uh, really great images, exactly the same images that I'm running here into both my Facebook and my Instagram profile. So I'm going to use this image, I'm going to hit now into open, and here's my profile picture. And now everything looks correct. Now, to have access directly into the ads manager of the Facebook, what I'm going to be doing here is just to start with my very first ad campaign. So I'm going to close this. Inside the meta business suit, let's focus into the web hot, which says all the tools. And here into all the tools, you want to focus and look out for advertised. The advertised can be showing you the ads manager. If I go for ads manager, this one should be sending us directly into the ads manager of Facebook. So what I wanted to do now is to log in using my portfolio and to start creating here. If you don't have an ad account, you have to worry about it. You can always go back here into Meta Business Suite, look out for the settings, and inside the settings, you might be having access to all your user uh, elements. So for example, I can go here inside the manager, the settings manager, and inside the settings manager, I'm going to locate my account. So to create your very first campaign back into Ads Manager, let's focus here into Create. In Create, you can choose if you wanted to have an actual buying type, for example, an auction. Here in to choose a campaign object, I wanted to choose if this one is wellness, traffic, engagement, leads, and more. For Instagram ads, I can totally recommend you to choose traffic and go for continue. Now here, uh, if you're just getting started, choose the recommended settings so you can have used preset campaign optimizations to help make your goals. So this one includes Advanced Plus Audience, Advanced Plus Placements, and so much more. So I'm going to hit now into Continue, and you are having access directly here into the campaign. Choose your campaign name, and here into the ad set, I can choose how much money I would like to spend. In this case, I wanted to send traffic to my Instagram profile. So I send people in here, the bet control, my budget schedule, how much money I would like to spend. You can spend, for example, let's say $2 daily, so you can start somewhere. 
And now it's going to be asking you where you want her to focus on. For example, the locations, you can add much more elements. You can, of course, add the audience suggestion if you wanted to. And you're actually good to go. The last thing to do is to add your custom ad to check out how it's actually going to be looking here into Instagram. So for example, here, I have the ad created. I use my Facebook page, but I'm going to be using my Instagram account, which in this case is this one. So check out how it's actually going to be looking. Now here's my ad name. We can add an actual media. You can add an image, the video or whatever to get starting and sell your actual elements. What I can tell you just to is to try to use videos rather than just images because they're going to be really much more engaging rather than just images. Once you have actually got this process, you can focus now into published. And once you've done this process in the publish, you needed to wait just a few hours till your actual campaign is now active. And there you have it. This is how we can actually run ads into Instagram in 2024. You can do this using your mobile inside the Instagram application, but this is the most manual and easiest solution to receive, for example, received and earned, uh, let's say saved a lot of budgeting. So be sure to like, subscribe, and hit the notification bell if you want to get more tutorials and tips on this digital marketing. Thank you for watching this video, guys. Hopefully, with all that, we'll see you in the future. Brand new section with Textpress. See you next time.